Hello, welcome to Crit Couch. I'm Michael. And I'm Skyler. We're gonna try and uh, get through this stage now. We were sitting here, because this guy's apparently on randomization, and he also says, remember this, but it took like 50 cycles before it showed up again, and Skyler convinced me he wasn't insane. Yeah. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> the delirium set in. He's gone yeah. now. <laughs> <laughs> this time. Epity, epity, epity. I still love that we ended the last episode with just Blinky laying in the fucking ground. <laughs> yeah, try try to not do that again. I think Blinky's my favorite. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, he's still weird looking, don't get me wrong. But I just, I kind of love his little butt blaster that he's got. <laughs> Dude, this, fuck this, man. Like, this really messes with my head. <laughs> oh, what, the up-down? Yeah. It is really easy on that to, uh to misgauge the height off that first jump and because there's three of those arrows in a row if you do that you're like pretty screwed I say as I like run right into that shit okay this I'm pretty screwed <laughs> uh, okay this is what got me why don't you blink last... you over oh, oh, oh I don't like that <laughs> <laughs> uh. oh god fuck me <laughs> All right. It's You're all right. not right there? Yeah, just a little tighter than I was a few <laughs> seconds ago. <laughs> you know, I always sucked at these. Like, any time a oh, game the had... the timing. Yeah. yeah, there's a there's a real... Mm, there's a real weird... I just... <laughs> it'd be a what, honey? <laughs> sorry, I just, like, stood right in that, but the... That was weird. Um... There's a predictive element to it. I mean, like that's I think what really screws people up. And those like move so quick, you have to kind of be able to to feel the rhythm. I mean, in a lot of ways, it's it's sort of like the. Is there uh, a robo pig in the? Yeah, there's it? about to be some shit here. Are um, they frogs or pigs? They're like robo toads. You see, like they're big. That big bottom lip. Yeah. Like, yeah, I got you. But yeah, there's an interesting kind of predictive. rhythm to it. Um, well, that worked. Uh, because, like, I mean, I think this is where, like, my musical background either helps or I have a musical background because, you know, I don't know if it's a chicken and egg thing or whatever. Can he only walk in one direction? Yeah, these this are, like... Mega Man X all over again. Yeah, I mean, this is right back to, like, Who built you know, these? good job, doctor, whomever. Yeah. You fucked up. How do you get the one up? Oh, you yeah. gotta use Ducky, huh? Yeah, uh, yeah, but I'm not gonna. Um. God damn it. Oh, <laughs> All right, let's do this. Okay. Super groove into the music. Yeah, you know, I, I think it came up a little, like, a few episodes ago. Maybe it's it did. rather more forgiving than I remember Nintendo 64 being. <laughs> oh, this, uh, yeah, this game kind of across the board, and I, I mentioned this earlier on, like, there is a lot of refinement that happened. Like I think I mentioned Battletoads at one point. You know, it was kind of an influence. Like the the snakes uh, that were in the ice level, <laughs> and um, there's snakes in in this level as well. But those were heavily influenced. I mean, like even down to the kind of stripy nature. Like there's there definitely was some cross referencing um, between. God, come on. All right, trying I'm to trying it. to like get close enough to that one up to oh, get it, yeah. but I was. There we go. Um, Not cooperating. Yeah. Ooh, but... that's a uh, weird one. Yep. <laughs> Michael. <laughs> well, no, I think you have to like time. The... No, I've actually done this with the jump. Oh. Um, I've jumped to that thing. I just like jumped early there. <laughs> uh. But yeah, there's a there was a, a really interesting, and you'll see this actually in the the final areas of this stage as well. Uh, they they definitely took a lot of influence from a number of other games to make this, and I think that's part of ultimately why I think it holds up because there are difficult pieces to this. There are some things that I think definitely classify as maybe like Nintendo unfair. Versus, you know, say the Nintendo hard. Like, I think those, uh... Nintendo unfair. I, yeah, I mean, it's an... Imp okay, I'm gonna try this one time just to ju try and vindicate myself. But if not, then I'll I do mean, this could, with Blinky. You could be... <laughs> I hit the jump button too late that time. 
You can jump that with Bucky. You just have to hit the button at like the exact right moment. And the first time I was too early, the second time I was too late. So this time I'll just blinky it. Um, <laughs> Captain Blinky. <laughs> Captain Blinky, oh. No, <laughs> doesn't doesn't work that way. Um, but uh, they they definitely learned a lot from those other games. Um, Cause like the Battle Toads, for instance, uh, snake segments. You know, a lot of people get stuck on the uh, the Turbo Tunnel, which is a pain. But the snake section is probably. I don't know if it's the worst, but it is definitely one of the worst segments of that game because it's so fast and you have to memorize all of the snake patterns. And I mean, it's basically built to screw you up if you have not, uh, if you haven't like actually gone through and learned a lot of it. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, I felt it. I knew yeah, it was going to go too. wrong. Yeah, I did too. Like, I was, <laughs> I was actually trying to go for the one on the left, and I... Blinky Overshot. Well, Blinky skewed too far right, and he landed on that platform, and then I was trying to jump off. Don't you dare blame Blinky for... <laughs> no, I mean, it was me. It was just Blinky's mechanics and me. Mm -hmm. But, like, the, the battle to snake zones just they suck like I you know I, I know a lot of people are like Battletoads is, is hard and I mean it is hard and they they like it for that but I honestly because of the way Nintendo worked I I think Battletoads has a lot of like truly bad parts in it because you can't you can't really reliably practice your way out I wonder if this is I'm just being stupid about this Cause see, I thought you'd jump on one of those, then jump up. Yeah, the problem is I need to time the the Bucky hop so that I don't, so don't spike myself spike. in the head. Wow, I was trying to type in yeah, battle toads. I type in bail tower. That's a thing, sure. Um, Snake. I can't believe this fucking jump is what's. Ugh, God. This isn't. Whoa! This looks insane. Oh, you're looking at the the snake. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, they. Uh, Holy fuck. Yeah. So, if you don't know what it is and don't feel like looking it up, um, it's bullshit. Yeah. So the way that you know the way the snakes in this game work is they come kind of out of the ground. There's there's three snakes per screen, and um, oh man, I have just had a thought. What um, would that be? Uh, well, you just if climb? I can, if I can use him to just climb that. What the fuck was that timing? <laughs> huh? No, I saw. <laughs> no, yeah. Was it like off? That has never been a problem. No, yeah, that was really weird. I mean, it may just be that I've jumped through it fast enough to not hit that weird timing in the past. That's really strange. Um. Actually, that might that's probably exactly what it is because it took me a, a couple more times to hit this jump. Um, but so, like... God, I've lost a lot of lives in this dumb fuck space. That's irritating. Um, there we go. You got this. Yeah. No, it was just like, this is not a terribly difficult jump to get through, and I've lost a lot of lives on it for no good reason. Yeah, no, I know. <laughs> All right. Okay. Stop watching. <laughs> no, that's fine. Just trying to see if I can. Yeah. Well, that just trivialized that whole fucking yeah. deal. I have kind of a blind spot with Deadeye because I did not when I like when I was younger, I didn't really use him a lot aside from like the most obvious spots like this. And so there are times when I just don't. I still to this you day. Yeah, about his toolkit. Yeah, basically. I don't think ah, this part. Um. So this is. This isn't, like, hard. It's just kind of annoying because you have to sit here and watch. Um, sure. That kind of just walks right off. Because you can, if you're standing in the wrong spot, drop to your death. Okay. So you gotta chill here. Yeah, fuck that up. Um. This is weird. Yeah, so this is a really cool experiment, I'd say. Yeah. Except it in practice, it's like really kind of frustrating because 
because you don't have like a clean rotation and it's having to load in different sprite backgrounds, it, it makes it kind of tough to, to visualize where you are and where you need to be. I remember something like that. I want to say Little Big Planet, actually. Oh, yeah? <laughs> yeah. Well, I love that game, by the way. Is there more to that, or is just that no, was... No, okay. I just... This is giving me a weird deja vu. Yeah, like, you know, it's like I was saying, rotational stuff is not... They experiment with a lot of yeah. puzzles in this game. Yeah, like, it's not an unusual experiment to do. And this is... Uh, here we go again. Is this the snake? Yep. Or it's more snakes. Multiple yeah. screens of snakes. Alright. Um, but you're actually having to write... No, this time they put little assholes in the way. Yeah, like, there's a limited number of these, but... If, if you're not careful and you, like, try to jump... Well, fuck one that of them, guy. Yeah, one of them will just, like, pop up and... Like, you can actually make it to this point in the screen. Um, oh, God, I'm trying to remember if one of these screws you because <laughs> there's that one on the ice level that comes yep. right down on your head um but yeah like they don't trigger immediately but so like if you get if you get far enough ahead one of these guys can like pop down when you're in the middle of a jump and just knock you straight into the pit and it really sucks um so far i'm enjoying the ones that just that's that just die one. Like that, like that one. He's like, brother, I join you. These toads fucking suck, man. Okay, I think. Oof. Yep. That one is a trick because that that head, it makes you think. Makes you think, boy. But so, I did leave the stove on. Yeah. <laughs> what? I don't know, man. <laughs> You gave me way too much pizza, and now it's a problem. You gave yourself that pizza, dude. Like, you ate that whole thing. That was... Yeah, I did tell the waitress. It's like, I've decided to hurt yeah, myself yeah, today. You, on your... Th it was a six-slice pizza. <laughs> and I'm sitting there across the table from him, and he's on his third slice. And he's like, all right, this is my last one. And then I look back up, and he's on the fifth slice, <laughs> and the waitress comes up. <laughs> okay, here's the boss. You got to thumber him? What I don't know what I'm looking at here. Yeah, this is just a series of bullshit turrets. What? Yeah, fuck. I forgot about this. And I'm low on lives. This is not hard. Uh, just there's an easy way to do this, but it can go a little bit wrong if you're not careful, and it's kind of going wrong. There we go. Okay, there's one. Ah. Oh no, you got this. No, I probably don't. I mean, you said that on that one boss, and then you never got hit again. I don't feel like that's happening here. No, it's not. Good night, sweet prince. This, this is actually, like, way harder to pay attention to all of the shit going on. There's a lot. Shit, man. It's not that bad. It's just if Willie can get off his his thumber, like, really fast. <laughs> Jesus. For fuck's sake, man. <laughs> it's No, I'm, I'm with you. Yeah, see if I can... Just get this guy. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Okay, now it's now it's pretty easy. Okay, what do you have to kill still? We've got a. Oh, okay. Oh, what? It's all that. Oh no. Oh, sorry. I should keep talking. I was just. <laughs> oh God! I was we really just like, go totally silent. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah I realized I was, that myself. I, I think like, we were both just like, oh fuck. <laughs> uh, sorry. <laughs> no, I was. I, yeah. Yeah, but yeah, that's that's the power of the summer. <laughs> I don't. I still don't understand what I was looking at there. Uh, yeah. I don't know. Hurry up! I don't know who's talking right now. I forgot who did the voices. I did like all of them, but okay. also I forgot. I don't know who's talking. It's just like this amalgamation of all of their voices. We're about to, this thing's about to blow. We're out of here, Captain. <laughs> oh God, dead eyes. Yeah, his laugh. So here we get to another kind of interesting part of this. Um, what is that? 
So now we have like a little. Ship. So this kind of goes back to you know Konami's racing and uh, or not racing, but like their their shoot 'em up design. Because you know I think I mentioned. God, what getting, are those? This is fire. Okay. You know I mentioned like earlier on um, during one of the levels. We're just not gonna do that. Um, where um, the uh, what was it? God damn, this is really hard to pay attention now to you're and good. talk. I tell you what. No, no, but like I mentioned earlier, like from the from uh, the Gradius um, stuff. I fucking. <laughs> you just had to go for it, huh? Well, I mean, it was probably gonna happen no matter what. <laughs> um, tell you what. Next time on Crit Cash, we're gonna come back to the middle of all this crazy shit. Oh <laughs> no. Oh, Can you even up, pause it? Up. Yep, here we go. Okay. Next time on Crit Cash. It doesn't look like fire. It <laughs> it looks like a chunky turd. <laughs> it it does. You see it. Like you've had one of those weird like I've never one that looked like blue brains or like I don't know, man. Wait, are are blue poos not normal? You know, it's funny you say that. <laughs> Allie's, one of her roommates, like, had one one time because she ate so much cotton candy that was blue that, like, all well, the Well, wait, 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 wait. Hold on. I came in with a joke. Blue poop can happen? <laughs> well, yeah, it's just die. <laughs> oh,